Okay, here we have our financial market, and the question now is what happens in this market if there's a decrease in the level of output and a simultaneous increase in the money supply? So to analyze this, we will start off with this is our demand for money, there's our money supply, and this is the current equilibrium interest rate. And we're going to first look what happens when the level of output decreases. Now, when the level of output decreases, it means less transactions is, transactions is going to be done in the economy, and so less money is needed. So the demand for money decreases. In your diagram, this means the demand for money curve shifts to the left, and you have a lower interest rate. There's this drop in the interest rate because of the lower demand for money. If simultaneously there's also now an increase in the money supply, then in terms of your diagram, this causes a shift to the right of the money supply. And as you can see now, you even have a lower interest rate. So you have another round of decrease in the interest rate. So the end result of these two forces is then a much lower interest rate.